What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. Here I provide educational info just for you. Such kind of content involves Valentine's Day. It's the perfect day for couples to show their love for each other. If you like this day, comment down below your favorite thing about Valentine's Day. We've all known about it our whole lives, but how much do we really know? Let's find out today as you look at Valentine's Day and what to know about it. Despite being a day of love, Valentine's Day had dark origins. The ancient Roman holiday known as Tupacaria, which took place in the middle of February, was meant to celebrate fertility. In it, men sacrificed a goat and a dog and used the hide from these animals to whip women. This was a popular holiday at the time. There were many people named Valentine. There were two Valentines that had many similarities with both being Christian and martyrs. They both even died on February 14th in the 3rd century. It was only when Pope Julius ended Lupercalia in the 5th century that the Catholic Church celebrated the martyr St. Valentine on February 14th. A professor at the University of Kansas, Jack Urge, stated that poets such as Shakespeare used Valentine's Day to be known for romance. This happened around the 14th century. This is because Valentine's Day is a time when European birds start meeting. Many holidays have their own mascot. Christmas has Santa, Easter has the Easter Bunny, and Valentine's Day has Cupid. Cupid is a baby with wings that flies around with bow and arrows. Modern day Cupid is based on the Greek god of love named Eros. Eros was immortal and handsome. He had arrows to mess with the emotions of gods and men alike. By the time Eros was adopted by Roman culture, he was known as Cupid. His appearance also changed to look like the one we know today. Valentine's Day is a popular holiday around the world. During this day, couples get together and show their love for each other. There are a few traditions in it. Some of these are exchanging roses and chocolates and going on romantic dates with a significant other. However, Valentine's Day is celebrated in different ways in different places. In Estonia and Finland, Valentine's Day is celebrated as Friends Day. This day is meant for people who are single and people who are in a relationship. In South Africa, young women will pin the name of their crush on the sleeve. This is public and is seen by everyone. This is based on the Lupercalia festival. In Argentina, it is a normal Valentine's Day and is also a week in July known as Sweetness Week. If you kiss someone during this time, that person gives you a sugary sweet. In Japan, women give men gifts on Valentine's Day, while men are expected to return the fever on White Day on March 14. In South Korea, there is a Valentine's Day and a White Day similar to Japan, but here there is a holiday on April 14 known as Black Day. On this day, single people celebrate by eating black noodles. In addition to that, South Korea has a day for love on the 14th of every month. Some of these include Rose Day, Kiss Day, and Hugs Day. According to the NRF, Americans are expected to spend $20.9 billion this year, over $175.41 on average. This will be the second highest ever recorded. Furthermore, over half of everyone plan on celebrating this year. The most popular gifts to give out are candy, greeting cards, and flowers. This together cost $5.5 billion. Almost one third of Americans are having an evening out, which costs a total of $4.3 billion. Close to a quarter of people are buying jewelry, which costs over $6.2 billion. Men are spending $116 more than women, but slightly more women are celebrating Valentine's Day. According to Finder, 91% of the UK will be celebrating Valentine's Day, which generates 1.37 billion pounds, with 22 pounds being spent per person. Brits send over 25 million Valentine's Day cards each year. Movies are sometimes based on popular holidays. Valentine's Day is no exception. There are many Valentine's Day rated movies or episodes of TV shows. According to IMDb, there are 97 feature films related to Valentine's Day. On the other hand, many movies are released on this day. Going to the theaters is very common on Valentine's Day and thus movie studios use this to their advantage. 
in the past 10 years, 28 movies have been released on Valentine's Day. Well everyone, that's all for today's video. Remember to smash that like button before you leave. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video. If you have any video ideas for me to do, comment below. I'll be back in the next video. Thanks for watching.